Hey everyone, I am back at you with a Scale Club scoreboard update, but this time I'm on location at LSU. We are here in Austin, Texas. We came down for our big event of the year, Sales Mastery, and we had such a blast, right Reese? It was amazing and I can't get enough barbecue while I'm here in Austin as well. It's been awesome. Okay, I have had enough barbecue. <laughs> However, I had a blast at Sales Mastery. We had so much fun with all of you, all of our BDMs, all of our owners learned a lot but now we're down at lsu and we're spending a couple days learning about processes so we are stepping outside of our sales shoes and trying to put the operation shoes on they hurt a little more than the sales shoes do uh but we're having a lot of fun right Reese? oh absolutely and lead simple has delivered on this whole entire lsu experience and it's just been fun to be here so i can't wait to see what the, the second half is going to bring i know we're very excited so we are on day one and a half of three. Yeah. Um, and there's been some big takeaways, some big bomb drops. But Reese, what's your biggest takeaway so far? My biggest takeaway is Lead Simple just moving in and really owning the centralized technology piece, integrating with all of these other platforms so that it can make it easy for our property management partners to scale and not have multiple logins and just making it seamless. And also so the client has a better experience as well. I, you know what, that's something that I took away. It's like they are working really hard to make sure that the clients have such an amazing experience with their software. All of the integrations, Zapier, we, we heard today, RentBind, we heard uh, PMW, like lots of really, really good stuff has come from this conference, but I'm most excited about how they're here to support all of you guys. So uh, if you missed it this year, you're definitely wanna go to, gonna wanna go next year, but Let's dive into scoreboard because that's what we're here for. So let's share some of the numbers for November. Awesome. Uh, so in November, we had Atlanta, Georgia at 22, Utah at 20, Fort Worth, Texas at 19, Chicago, Illinois at 17, and Memphis, Tennessee at 14. Those were our scoreboard leaders. Overall, we were at 286 doors. That is down from October. So as we come into November and December, we anticipate a little bit of a slowdown and we are seeing that in the community. What else are you seeing in club race? Yeah. So inside a club, you know, November was expected with the Thanksgiving week, you know, going into December. We've also got that week between Christmas and New Year's. But what I'm hearing from a lot of my scale club members is those prospects are ready to make those decisions just after the first of the years. So right now, it's all about nurturing, keeping those prospects engaged so that when the time comes to make that decision as soon as new year comes they're on top of it and it's a seamless transition right into their property management portfolio i love that you know what that tells another story that we saw on the scoreboard we actually saw leads increased but doors closed decreased so in november leads increased to 33 but doors closed for our entire community. Average number of doors at RBDF closed was seven. But when you look at the top 50%, 10, that's actually down about 35% from October. So a fairly big drop. But I think it tells that story of people are just trying to figure out what's happening and people are going to jump and make big decisions come the new year. Yeah, I can see January being a really exciting month for our scale club members. So I'm looking forward to seeing how they nurture that pipeline from now until the first of the year. It's going to be exciting to see where they pull in. I think that's awesome. Well, we've got a really cool skill dev coming up here in mid-December. A little bit weird because we're not at the end of December like we normally do skill devs. But with the holidays, uh, we shifted up. So tell us about skill dev and what we're planning on doing. So it'll be December 15th and it will be on a Friday. So a little bit different like you mentioned. But it's going to be a recap of all of our skill devs throughout the year. What we've learned, what worked best. And then we're going to recap, recap that into a fun, exciting game for all of our Skill Club members. And even some of our owners are joining as well. So it'll be a fun one. I love it. And guys, make sure to bring your ugly sweater because that is the name of the game. If you want an invite to Skill Dev, just reach out to me, Jennifer at RentScale.com. I'll get you an invite. We would love to have you see what our community does and how we operate. And if you're not here in Austin with us this year for LSU and Sales Mastery, we hope you'll join us next year because it's been an incredible week of learning, growing, and scaling. Back to you, Jeremy.